Hey guys, this is Haim Aman Palman, the virtual wholesaler guy. Uh, just shooting another video for you. Uh, it's Friday and I like to reflect on Friday and share uh, my experiences uh, from the week with you. Uh, so this week again, very important lesson uh, because I didn't have a very good week uh, marketing wise. And I want to share with you because I think it's important lesson. So. Uh, as I mentioned to you in previous videos, I track all of my marketings and the leads and I started the year strong. I sent uh, the, the last week of um, 2016, uh, almost 4,500 mailers, uh, it was postcards and it was a disaster. I got only um, six calls. Uh, from which only three were leads, uh, which is only 0.13% response rate, which is terrible, uh, it's awful. And obviously no deals, I just got one appointment, uh, which is, is not bad, not bad given the fact that I had only six calls and, and three leads. And the last week, I send 3,500 mailers to an absentee owners list. Uh, again, and that's the money that I spent uh, last week and that's the previous week. And this time I got 38 calls, 32 of which were leads. Again, six told me that uh, we moved it from the list, not interested or, or anything like that. So that's a, a 1.07 response rate, which is a little better. Uh, and still calls trickling in because it's absentee so a lot of people have a PO box so it takes a few days for them to 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 get the mail so hopefully these numbers will will increase a uh, number of appointments I think I had a higher number so let me check <clears throat> so this week uh, with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, but I think only three um, were from um, absentee owners list. So, so again, only three appointments, which is again not not great ratio, uh, which means that ten leads uh, for every ten leads I got an appointment, and so far no deals from this campaign so so here's the lesson and again I just want to show you again the call rail if you are wondering so I just ran a report for again this is from the beginning of the year January 1st 2017 up until today so you can see a uh, 38 first time callers for the absentee owners list a uh, code violation to its other list that's running in the background and owner occupied again this is the sixth list that I mentioned of sending the 40 500 mailers. So um, I will not send again uh, mailers on the last week of the year. So anyway, so here's the lesson. So the lesson is that this is the breaking point for a lot of newbies. Uh, they spend what's together is uh, 27, 28, uh, a dollar on the three thousand dollar with the list and everything and they didn't close the deals and the phone is ringing but not good leads not good appointments uh, no money coming in and and this is the point where most people quit uh, that's the people that say that the what gurus teach uh, doesn't work uh, and this business is a scam and they just took my money and ran and, and they quit and they going back to their nine to five job and 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 that's it. That's their the experience with wholesaling. And 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 again, and when you have a pain point, this is when you need to push harder. So I just decided I'm just going to increase the mailers next week. So I send forty two hundred mailers to another list, um, spend more money and and I believe that the law of averages will prevail and the cost per lead for now for me it's $284 which is insanely high for Memphis. Uh, that's because of the disastrous mailing here uh, and 
over time the numbers will make sense and and I will start to see uh, results because this is seeds I just planted seeds and and maybe they will not be ready to sell me today but they will after they get another matters for me in four weeks and I will follow up with them um, every other week and we'll send them text messages and my lead managers will call them again and they will receive an email for me if we have an, their email um, and the lesson here is that this business is simple but it's um, it's not easy it's hard and, and you're not gonna see success uh, after your first mailer or after having again a coaching call with with someone uh, and you just need to grind it out and 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 send more mailers and believe in the process and um, and again if you're in a more competitive market maybe it would take you six months to to get a deal but it would be a bigger deal i don't know uh, i just know that over time uh, the numbers work and and i will share with you my results um, um, as i start to close deals and book more appointments because i feel that again i believe in the process uh, and I have systems in place to follow up and again most of the money is done from the follow-up this is just the second mailers of the year so I can't get discouraged here and that's I also again good lessons for my kids when it's hard uh, and when it's painful this is when you need to push harder uh, because that's winning time that's where everybody quits and only the strong people prevail and win so same lesson here in business uh, again, I don't know when the turnaround point will be, but I truly believe that this thing will turn around, the, the ROI will, will be there, I will get more calls, I will book more appointments, and I will close more deals uh, because I believe in the process. So that's it, just want to share with you my lesson for this week, uh, it wasn't a great week, uh, just got one contract, but again, none of them, it's from this mailer, it's just the hard property that I got. Um, but uh, keep pushing, uh, keep mailing, keep answering the phone call, uh, and and return messages, and and don't give up because again, it's only the where the weak people give up at this point and don't push forward. So that's my lesson for the week. Have a great weekend. Enjoy your time with your family, and I will see you next time.